is, it was standing room only at this Brexville City Council meeting and the topic that had everybody so fired up, sewers. The city just figured out some people were only paying half what they owed, which begs the question, how are they gonna come up with the rest? Will it be the people? or the city that sent them the wrong bills all this time. Well, the city just made a decision moments ago and News 5's Amanda Van Allen was there for it all. So Amanda, what's the verdict? Zanita and Rob, very tense in there at moments. We just found out moments ago, city council voted the city will be fronting the bill for these old sewers that the residents did not pay correctly, although they didn't know that they were paying the wrong amount for over 15 years. Now the city will be picking up the bill as well as the county. They will also be putting in some money. Now people who live in that subdivision, obviously they are very excited that they will not have to front this money, but other other residents who live in the community say there is no way we should be bailing them out. Now neighbors poured into the Brexville City Hall on Tuesday night. City Council in a tough position listening to comments after comments after comments, all because of a clerical error with sewers in one community. There was no 1200 and some dollar assessment. I bought my line for a $600 assessment. So people are like Jack Petchy, uh, anybody that wants a grandstand tonight, I would like you to tell me why you feel that I owe $600 more per year. Uh, I don't see why there's any obligation on the part of the city or anybody else to relieve the homeowners of the obligation for the assessment. Uh, there's nothing in the Ohio Revised Code that I'm aware of that says that if somebody makes a mistake sending out your tax bill, that relieves you of the underlying obligation. Here is how we got here. The residents who live in the four season subdevelopment were told $600 a year would cover their sewer assessments. But after 15 years, the city learned that cost was actually supposed to be double. So more than $681,000 are now owed. And just how that money is repaid is now equally as complicated. Now the more than $681,000 will come out of a special assessment fund with the sit which the city assures everyone is not any kind of tax dollars but residents say tonight they still believe that, that money will be coming out of their pockets one way or another we are live tonight in Brexville Amanda Van Allen news 5.